Good morning. Uh, today we're looking at a 2004 Bigfoot. This is a model 27 DSL. Uh, it's a double slide out Class C coach. Uh, measures about 28 feet six overall, you know, tip to tip. It is on an Ede 450 chassis. Um, the front here, I just, looks like there is one little scrape. Windshield looks good. Uh, this has a Ford 6.8 liter V10 engine. Inside we got flex steel captain's chairs, which are really nice. You find those in high-end class A's and motor homes. We got just under 31,000 miles. Uh, fires right up. There's no check engine or any uh, you know, flashing lights of any sort. Pretty low mileage. Obviously got power windows, power locks. Kind of a cold day here in the Pacific Northwest. Here's the slide out. You got tinted windows, really good basement compartment storage. This is all storage. There is one scrape that goes the side of the coach here. Outside shower. Um, looks like this is probably for potable water. Another storage compartment. You got uh, heated and closed dump valves, own in 4000 engine. Looks like this is for your uh, cable, satellite, maybe phone plug ins, and really good storage. Bigfoot was really renowned for quality, construction, and insulation, kind of ahead of their time. But you can kind of see how there's a little bit of a scratch from the, they may have hit something. A little bit of rust on the water heater. On the back here, this is a gel coat cap. It looks like somebody renewed this in July. It does have the rear receiver hitch for towing. Got a rear ladder. Here's the bedroom slide out. Uh, graphics look good. Exterior, you know, the fiberglass actually looks really good. I love the tinted windows for privacy. <laughs> Here's that other side of that basement compartment that does go through. A couple of scrapes here and there. Propane tank. I'm sorry, that's about three quarters full. Got a spotlight right up here, awning. More storage, more basement compartments. Those look like the slide out locks. Obviously you got a you know a large grab handle, dual electric step that opens when you you know pull it out. There's the dual batteries and those do pull out on the tray. A little more uh, storage right here. But that's the exterior. Let me see if I can pop inside and show you the interior.